some strong stats. Yeah, it's unfortunate stats, I guess. I, I, I guess, like, in, in German you say, like, once is never, and twice is a pattern. So, if, if you believe that, then Bio Kirby should have better chances. Yeah, so we're looking at this. Uh, both racers, 0% win rate, which, it happens. Mm. It's fine. Uh, Poketsune, a bit older, first joined MT14, finished 65th. Not bad. Not me. <laughs> Not bad, considering. Thank you, Joe. <laughs> uh, Bayo Kirby joined MT16, finished on 100th. That's a good, strong number, yeah. 100. 100 is good. I like it. Yeah. <clears throat> Very round. Uh, and I'm liking the, the little blurbs at the bottom. Uh, Poketsuna has all the salt, all the luck, both good and bad, and lots of floof. I mean, both of them. Bayo Kirby commits leperine actions constantly. What is a leperine? Leperine. I don't know. Some played it. Let's go find out. It is of or resembling a hair or hairs. So, rabbit like. But, so, they are the same flavor type. Hmm, basically. One's a fox, one's a rabbit. But doesn't have rabbit ears, apparently. Uh, oh. It's... Yeah, because leopard. I guess, yeah. The... I guess, yeah. Is it Volpine for both of them then? Based on the pictures? I mean, obviously both are foxes. Yeah. I'm pretty sure Volpine's the word for fox. <laughs> yeah. Uh. Oh, it's, it's like a... Like a... Our ish Japanese style Kitsune. Your Kirby is kind of looks like a Pokemon character. It's uh it's that stage one furry, I think. <clears throat> you should look at race chat, see what's going on in there. Not much. There is no game yet. Ooh. So how did yesterday's match go now that I think about it? Which one? There was more than one yesterday? I don't know. <laughs> uh, I, I remember Tasty Static, which was a game that is apparently ex also exists under another name. But that's basically a clone, like Sky something? I don't know. I don't remember games, I just play them. Uh, it was like a game where you, like, you're a spaceship and you're always going forward and you gotta go left, right, and jump in order to avoid obstacles in kind of like a cyberspace style. Oh, hmm, that's not bad. That's pretty good, but both of the racers when I knew it was one of those new versus new matches, and the game was pretty, like, brutal. I'll be excited to post the highlight of that one later. Also, Okami of Games making uh, a very good point. One of them is going to be breaking that losing streak today. <laughs> Hopefully. Become a running theme if this is the game that we play. <laughs> Number two? No, because we had that other game that we've played in the tournament already. That's basically the same idea. <laughs> oh, like a single screen, a card game one.
Well, we can't say much more without explicitly giving up what the game is about. <laughs> but his favorite game, Splash Lake. Oh, it's not. Oh, babe. Uh, have we had a tie in MT before? I know we did in, uh, in the one with the, uh, I mean, the FMV game. We got we got ties in top eight sometimes because. Well, I mean, a tie just means we get a new game, right? Reroll. Yeah. It's not like both players can advance into a tournament. Like they just double KO until they have to, you know. Everyone has to go. Until timeout. And this game has quite the cover. Yeah, it's good cover. Oh. My bad, I was looking at the cover for the first one. <laughs> have a, a test of did you read the paste bin really quickly oh well then no that's the question and that's two relatively new players then the answer i mean i'm sure it'll be fine The strongest submitter of this year is definitely going to be backup. Backup, I mean, quality-wise, also very impressive. <clears throat> very good. So far. All of these games, like, could have made any MT. The sick part of me wants somebody to join our community named Backup. <laughs> so that way, they just get attributed all of these things. <laughs> they don't even know why. Like, I'm famous for some reason. I'll, I'll take it, I guess. Roar can't do it. Roar's already got an established identity. We proved that with the reverse track is in. That's it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> the third Roar alt. <laughs> I don't like this song. Wait, well, hold on, I have a sleep to that. Do this song. Listen. <laughs> Wait, it's not here. Wait, it is here. What kind of heresy are you doing? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> I should have known. That's great. That's still like our most viewed video on the YouTube channel, by the way. The, the Is match? this race? Okay. Yeah. I mean, that was a good match, too. Oh, they're really good. Past matches uh, for these two. I don't, I don't think there have been any past matches for any of the racers anywhere. Yeah, I think it's only this tournament, isn't it? No matches. Yeah. It's not a, it's not a history of past matches. matches.
It gets me every time. Wow. Well, oh how? my god. <laughs> Nothing beats it. Hmm. I can definitely think of a few games where I wouldn't want a ground pound, but we don't know if we, that, that can be beaten in those games because we can't. Uh, Omega number. I think if you change your avatar and lock lock out and back in again, it's gonna update it on the website. I, I'm interested in new chess puzzles, I'm telling you. <laughs> Are you going to try to solve them in the card? Yes. Nice. I'm a big fan of chess puzzles. Did they make the music for the game? No. Ground uh, Pound was made by Bobo Bass. And... Yeah, it definitely is going to be Whiplash. that transition, I'm like... <laughs> ah. There's the e-break as we go careening off the highway <laughs> into Zelda. Yeah, I mean, I guess the music... I mean, it is like... That's not my fault. <laughs> no. The BPM doesn't quite match, I think. <laughs> Alright. The races have a game. Like we're gonna use this game, but setting up, taking a little longer. It's a weird console. <laughs> One of the races has a syntax error in the game. That's probably not good, <laughs> <laughs> but we'll work with it. And it's like one of those Apple II games or whatever, where you gotta like figure out how to install an operating system you can play the game. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really I'm really hoping when my match comes around. It's just here's another GBA game. Go race. <laughs> I don't want to have to deal with any weird emulators. This controls, year. normal controls. I see this song is good. I like this. Yeah, this this whole album was very good. The previous one was replaceable. Like, they did some good work on 25 Year Legend. Oh, it's the Minecraft man. Yeah. Kind of like a like a dark shadow of a sea for one beat. Oh, you're the guy who made the Minecraft music, yeah? yeah. I mean, I also make other music. Yeah, but you made the Minecraft music. I mean, the same thing can apply for Lena Rain. Oh, you made that one Minecraft song, Pig Step. Yeah, I also did amazing music for Celeste and other games. <laughs> But but pig step. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. This seems like an interesting problem. Maybe you should make a prediction. I should make a prediction. Oh god. <laughs> this guy who made the new Pokemon music. Like, yeah. Like some kind of. Oh yeah, all, uh, a third fox. All these foxes in the match. Give you guys a nice, healthy five minutes. No, I think we don't. Otherwise, we'll just be late already. We'll be like, oh, sorry, guys. On technical issues. Prediction. And this is a tough prediction because there's like not many past stats to go off on. 
One Truly. Them, one of them uh, has lost more than the other. A double blind. Well, the only reason why they've lost more is because they've been in an extra MT. <laughs> Wait, that's kind of... <laughs> I, say I mean, it's true. Both of it's them factually are true. <laughs> oh, oh, hold on. To be see with some valuable, valuable information. Who, who beat you in the reject race? I'm gonna predict. I'm an impartial member. Go with this. Some points in there. Some points for ants. To be honest, what are we even using points for anyways? Yeah, They're bragging rights now. Nothing really. <laughs> Once we figure out what to do with the points, they'll be so... It's been such a recurring theme across all the Twitch channels that I frequent. Nobody knows what to do with channel points aside from, like, drink water, stretch, bless curse runs. I don't like it when they have, like, annoying things, you know, like sound effects on the stream. Uh, sound effects depends on how you apply it. Like one of the Death Force streamers oh, I wait, watch. Wait, we, we, we got a game. Oh. Game oh, is. I hope. Oh, wait, hold on. Delaying for hold like breath. three more seconds for the stream to load. Uh, the game is. Uh, Kings Valley 2. It has a subtitle. Uh, the Seal of El Giza. I didn't yep. want to put it there. No, I must. It's fine, I'll figure it out later. <laughs> So this game was made by Konami and released for the MSX. Uh, the the running theme of this tournament is apparently pyramids and archaeology. Because <laughs> we also had pyramid magic on top of this. Oh, that's what you meant. I thought you yeah. meant like, like I said, once arcade games. I was also chuckling when you said that uh, Spelunky. The Spelunky music could go away. I was thinking, man, that's right on brand, though. <laughs> yeah. Prediction is too long. And... Mm -hmm. I mean, it works fine any other Probably. Probably. Whatever. It'll be fine. Yeah, it's an MSX game. Look at that cover. Kind of small, but... Tells you nothing. Yeah, so the goal is to beat Stage 7. The players were given a code to give them a lot of lives. If you give me a second, I can get you the number. <laughs> uh, 47 lives. It's a lot of lives. 47. That's a weird number. And they are given passwords to, I guess, skip up levels. Uh, should they die after 47 lives? I hope not. I, I, we really hope that they live. So let's see, is there anything notable in here? Oh, this music. Yeah. Like, this is the kind oh, of wait, title that screen. wasn't the game music? <laughs> oh, yeah, it was also fitting, but no. Game, the, this title <laughs> screen, it doesn't look like the type of title screen that has music. We got this beautiful, very stereotypical... Like, Egyptian thing. Far East. Yeah, I guess. Let's see, the odds are in favor of Pulp Kitsune taking the win today. 61 to 39, let's see what happens.
the stream has not died. No. It hiccuped up for a second. No, no, it didn't. That's what I'm saying. It's not fully dead like yesterday, apparently. It was weird. I don't know. Like, it connected and then my OBS was like, okay, I'm just not gonna reconnect ever again. Mm. I'm like, oh, that's, big that's cool, you... that. I mean, what Konami has? Solid Snake. I'm pretty sure he has apps. Everybody in Metal Gear has apps, so they have plenty, I think. I just remember the fight scene. <laughs> With the shirtless liquid on top of yeah. eggs. Come on, yeah. Snake! Alright, looks like we're going to be starting. Right password. We did it. First hurdle right. has been taken. So the objective of the game is to collect all these soul stones. The soul stone. You mean the orbs? Yeah. Well, that's what they're called in the face bin is soul stones. Oh, we. That's a weird pattern to dig. And then reach the exit door, which is this uh, this one at the top, I believe. Why did Poke Tsuna die? I fell, maybe. I don't know. Oh, it, it loops. Hmm. So it's important to note that we have on the screen a couple of tools. So a pickaxe and a drill. And you can only use one of the each of those once. Uh, but the weapons that you get, so like the sword, and there's going to probably be a boomerang later. We can use repeatedly. Oh, the music is back. Interesting. I'm kind of scared it's kind of the kind of game where if you press M, it toggles the music. And maybe it's uh, like... it definitely it definitely does. There is a button to toggle the music on and off. And then it's it's maybe like global. You know, if you go to IRC and you type Okay, I'm ready. And it goes like, Oh, you wanna mute the music? Uh it's also worth noting in the paste bin. Uh, turning the music off can actually speed up the game, so for the sake of this race, keep the music on. Oh! Okay, hold on, let's check Bio Kirby if they're confirming, conforming with the rules. They are. Alright, good. <laughs> gotta, gotta check. It's important. Alright, both players have collected all the, the orb. Trying to get to the finish, but... I guess they have Can to jump, jump over this? Yeah, here we go. Oh, be careful. But yeah. cleverly waits. They must do it. That was oh, easy. They're quite even. Yeah. It's just gonna be a 14 minute match. Oh no. <laughs> so let's see. Right, so it's we... apparently a map in this game. Map. This... Oh, what? Yeah, I don't, I don't know why you'd need it. <laughs> I can see the whole world. Okay, I agree with this drilling. Eat your heart out, guy Spelunky. I bet you wish you had a drill. <laughs> can you always stick diagonally down? Uh, I don't know if you can dig. Dig. So it's... Ah, I see. So when you dig down, it goes half a tile in front of you. Yeah, yeah, but can you always do that? I mean, I assume. Oh, these are like one-way doors that turn when you go through the digging through that one place wasn't good at all. Imagine getting a Super it... Bond game and it's little 7 now. That'd be disgusting. <laughs> I'd be terrified. Okay, Pokestone has the electric encryption drill. Should we go for the finish? Yeah. Here we go. And Bio Kirby is gonna pick up the drill right now. Can also do it from the other side. As long as he makes the jump here. Oh, I guess accidentally walked off. That's fine. 
try again. Falcatsune yeah, taking a bit of a lead here. On the stage three. Oh, ma maybe you can jump with the drill? Uh, where, where? I know I read that somewhere. You cannot jump while holding an item and cannot put down items without using them, so think okay. carefully about when to pick them up. Oh, what's happening here? The door is closing. Oh no, it's different rooms. Something. Yeah, it has to be different rooms, because there are no spirit orbs in this one. Maybe they're like hidden in the ground. I don't know. They're soul orbs, my bad. <laughs> oh, here's the pickaxe. So the pickaxe is an item that you can. Do. Oh, here's all the, all right. the orbs. So you gotta figure out which items you have and how you can get to all of these things. And how to get back out. They have a boomerang down there. Oh, I thought it was like a chair. <laughs> a nice recliner. Okay, I'm gonna use this pickaxe to not die to the mummy. Well, to dig up Drill Drill and Pickaxe. Which I think should be enough to get all the orbs. Yeah, pick up, uh, Pickaxe to the top right one, and then Drill to the left to get out of there, and then Drill to the bottom left. Picking up the Pickaxe, good choice. Oh my, we get a raid for 171 people from the Mexican Runner, thanks man. Ah, oh, the Mexican Runner! We tried to reach you about your insurance. No, about your <laughs> signing up for this tournament. We tried to reach you about your mystery tournament extended warranty. <laughs> I think I think Pokesu ah went the wrong way, and I guess didn't see a way to avoid the mummy. But that's yeah. the right idea, I believe. Like, the, the order of operations is kind of important in this level. Yeah. Oh, picked up the sword! But I guess it doesn't matter. Yeah, just... Right. No, Could have also just gone and killed the mummy, but I guess it respawns after some time, so it doesn't even really matter. The mummy has a reach before going into the pit. Pulls away Bao Kirby's soul. Alright, drill to the left. Same thing Pokitsuna did last time. It's gonna leave, which is fine because you gotta go there anyway. Oh, loops! That's smart. <laughs> this is some this is some spelunky cosmic ocean stuff that's given me fear, man. <laughs> Looping weapons falling through the void. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Oh no! Went in before the mummy, and the mummy just trapped him. How far Bio Kirby has figured this As the pickaxe, which is a different. No, I don't think this works, because if you use the pickaxe here, no matter where, you will not be able to get back out. So you have to start with the drill. It also occurs to me you need to have one pickaxe left over at the end in order to get to the exit. Oh, that's true. Because you can't drill across because there's holes on the side. Oh. Wait, uh, but are these all the items we have? These six. Like, uh, three each, I guess? Looks like it, yeah. Well then, how does this work? Okay, let's think about it. We gotta get out, so I think drilling where Paul Kitsune has been drilling is a good idea. Like, at the bottom of the big ladder in this room. Bio Kirby. No longer. This room. Can you drill with a uh, on the ladder? Yeah, I guess we drill twice. But no, no, you could just drill, drill three times in this room then. It's obviously you obviously want to drill three times in the right room because the drill doesn't do anything for. Yeah. It 
to stage three? Uh, what's Rick? the book gonna do? Oh, doing oh, that that's, first. Okay. That's not good. <laughs> oh, the mummy is in there. Now has, yeah, mummy trapped oh, no. in the exit. I mean, I, would you reset here? Would you even try? Uh, it depends on where exactly moving on to the next level triggers. Oh, it died! It got confused and hurt itself. <laughs> Alright, good drill. Oh, wait a second. See, now you don't need to use uh, the uh, the ladder. The top of the ladder is a standing platform. I see. Okay, we're getting so a drill. So you can drill. just walk across the drill. We're getting a drill. This is not enough. Two drills will not be enough, I think. Or will they? Yeah, well, because you just. Um... Oh. Because you could stand on the top of the ladder oh, yeah, and just yeah, drill yeah, once you're, to go to the right, right, and then you go to the bottom. Ah, okay, yeah. So Poketsuna has this. Yeah. Let's see how far Bio Kirby is. Uh, just that, I believe. Well, I mean, like, in the process of figuring out how in, to beat the level. Yeah. In a heading to the exit. And Bayo Kirby gets pinned by the mummy. That's a pretty significant lead, I guess. Like, oh, this was a long level. Basement, don't we? Let's come for changing the basement again. H4. This yeah, is this is the pace bin you want. I, I unfortunately don't remember the command to change it. <laughs> like edit com. I like this. Nice. Can't believe I did that first try. All right. Okay, so I'm making good work. Has a hammer. What's the hammer do? an excellent question. I uh, Hammer is an uh, alternate version of a drill, apparently. Wow. Exciting. That was exciting. Maybe it only goes through one layer? Wait, this is already solved. As long as Pokesuna can jump over this. Yeah, well... This level was so much easier. Gotta kill the... Different colored mummy. The clean bandaged mummy. Yeah. <laughs> Not practicing good hygiene. Don't don't eat the yellow bandages. <laughs> don't think you should eat any bandages, to be honest. <laughs> oh, there's also like the pickaxe, the shovel as well as the hammer. Yes. This is kind of big. Kirkusuna on 5, Bio Kirby on 3 still. And not looking very close to solving this. Oh, we got hopping mummies now? Please. Also, he's climbing the ladder. The shovel? What are we doing with the shovel? Oh, we oh, can. Down, oh, yeah, we can shovel the ceiling. Or... Oh no, that's bad. Oh no, <laughs> that's a reset. Did not mean to do that one. I wonder if this is going to be one of those games where, like, level seven just close lines you. There's like ten different screens 
15 items, gotta use them all in the right order. Uh, I mean, in this one you just use the hammer to get to the orb, right? This seems easy. Uh... The problem is you can't jump with the, any items. Oh, that's true. Yeah. So you'd have to dig down uh, to the right of the orb? Oh. Yeah, I like this. then loop around with this the is hammer. so much just running in a circle <laughs> I got the hammer we'll be able to clear the right side of this level and also just kill the stupid popping swings again or not? Or I would be scared of going. I worked out. It wouldn't surprise me if there's some aspect to from this that Lemulana took. Bokutsune it visually looked similar. That is true. Bokutsune isn't sure whether to go like left circle or right circle. It looks like left circle is gonna work. Uh, do we have another... Wait, where's the hammer? Wait, no, we don't need a ham hammer. You know, this is fine. No, we just jump across. We're good. Easy peasy. Alright, take the sword with you. Or the boomerang, whichever. Yeah, okay, go get him. Oh, this is unfortunate. <laughs> there we go. And Biok resolves three. Moving on. Good, good. But no, the enemies respawn. Your goal is just to collect all the orbs and get to the exit. Yeah, but you can see there's like locks on the door. And every time you collect an orb, it removes the lock. Oh, that's the map. For a brief moment. That was useless. We were enlightened. No, squares and dots. Alright, two more levels for Pokitsune. Probably hard levels, considering previous well, this level isn't very big either there's, there's a boulder coming yes little look out will it start to spontaneously moving oh using the ice block and then the drill uh, okay never mind not using the drill oh but we don't have any shovels yeah you have to use the b pushing block with the drill so poke it sooner correctly identifying that. yeah yeah I think immediately. This, that's important to know when you when you can no longer go when you have to restart. Yeah, situational awareness, very important skill here in mystery tournament. Getting the drill first. I don't know if it matters. Can you push a block with with an item. Has been saying anything about this? Out of the way, boulder. Oh, you can just stand on top. Yeah, Facebin says while the uh, while the boulders aren't moving, you can stand on top of them. Oh, what? Why are we restarting? I thought this was fine. Could he jump over the boulder? He could just wait for the boulder to go down. Uh, yeah, he just runs to the, to the right, and then falls off. Are we doing this one first? I think that's a good idea, because you don't want to be down here when the boulder is here. Boulder man. True, true. Can you kill boulder man? No way. Boulder man is too strong. He's made of rock. Place the thing, get the other drill. And undecided which way to go. Oh. Man. Oh. Oh. So if Pocket soon times this, they can survive at least and then do another run. 
but you gotta like hurry up, I guess. This is mummy is gonna respawn, and the the boomerang is no no longer. Oh, uh, oh no! Oh, that's bad. I mean, this is bad for all kinds of reasons. It's bad on multiple levels. <laughs> can't get to the drill. Can't get past the mummy. <laughs> oh, there we go. That's one. I mean, yeah, no, no. Sure. I mean, you gotta go now. It was your only chance. That is bad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there I it mean, is. like, if you were gonna try something, it's to get over the mummy as it's, like, looking around. It's the only possible out here. So, so what do you do, anyway? What's the solution here? The, the mummy seems to respawn too quickly. For you to kill it with the boomerang, go back up the ladder and then grab the drill. Uh, hmm. Oh, the mummy will be one. Yeah, we saw that earlier. Yeah, 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 but I, I didn't consider that. But will it wait long enough to respawn? Oh, the boulder died. Oh, rock's dead. Yeah. By just pushing a block into it, that makes sense. It telefragged. <laughs> we <laughs> weakest rock ever. Huh? Oh, so pockets in a good way. Just... No. Reset. But I don't know what the other solution is then. Will the boulder kill the mummy? No. How do you know that? I think we saw it, didn't we? The boulder continued on after we got squished. I don't know. I wasn't watching. I guess not then. I don't think it will. But was. like the the sword isn't gonna help because you have to grab the drill before dropping down to where the mummy is, right? So even if we go up there, grab the sword and bring it to like a position where we can later kill the mummy using the sword. I don't think it will help. Was the boulder open? That, that is a good the boulder, question. The boulder is a man. Oh, and whoa. the man definitely killed us <laughs> when, it, when it opened. Well, what's the solution here? You can't use the boulder to get across the gap. Oh, that was rude. Oh, oh, that was just rude. Bad timing. Yeah. <laughs> what the OB Kirby is doing? Is solving the right side of the screen, and this is the last side for Bio Kirby, so this is another clear for her. Very good, very good. So just one level behind, let's say 1.5, because Pokitsune is like in the process of solving this. There's some cooking going on here. Boulder enemies is going, oh, I was supposed to fall further, wasn't I? <laughs> oh, that, that looked like it was going to work. Like it was going to go and give you 400 points. Why didn't you just ground pound? <laughs> <laughs> What's this? Uh, I, oh, maybe the boomerang can spawn camp the mummy. Mm, that's, uh, that's an idea. I don't think so. <laughs> If we light it on fire, maybe. It always seems like mummies are more of a problem than issue in movie. I mean, there's only been like one actually threatening mummy in cinema, in my opinion. Yeah, and we had Brendan Fraser to save us. Thank goodness. <laughs> <laughs> but I like, um,. That's like another thing that someone might do wrong when it's the first time they're doing this. Uh, doing the hard part of the level first. So Pokitsuna doesn't know how to get this drill out of here in order to like, get one of the two sections. That's particularly bad. <laughs> yeah. But no, it's, it's just oh. gonna die, right? Yeah, it, it just died. And Bale Kirby's on the same level now. That was fast. I mean, that was about as fast as Pocket Soon, I guess. I 
I don't know what the solution here is. The sword, how does it help? How does having all the weapons in the world help when you have to get out of here with a drill? How are you supposed to do anything when your enemy is immortal? I mean, maybe it's a different mummy every time. We're killing a lot of mummies. Oh. Yes. But I don't see how the, the sword is gonna help. Can you crush enemies with blocks? That's not gonna help because you need the block here. Wait, no, I guess you don't. But you can't get the block down there, can you? Uh, no. There's no space on the right of this here. Look, just take a page out of Payday and drill the mummy. I'm guessing what Zoniko says about the uh, respawn and despawn timer. Just wait it out, you think? I mean, I, I don't see the proper solution. Will the mummy climb the ladder? No, I don't think these mummies know how to climb ladders. They died before ladders were invented. How long is the respawn timer? It's not possible for us to go all the way around, is it? No, I mean, that's what Pokitsune has been trying. Alright, Berg. Bio Kirby is kind of at the same stage as Pokitsune. Has collected the left part. Has the drill, and it's gonna discover... Dead. Yep. Pokitsune is just observing now. What will the boulder do? The boulder! Well, don't stand here. The boulder is gonna go to the right. They can't, they can't stand anywhere else, Maurice. Well, they they could have dropped down on the left. Ah, <laughs> didn't throw the boomerang in time. Didn't Australia fast enough. A shame. We're probably doing the same thing of uh, a... like yeah, so okay. solving the unknown part first. It probably seems obvious, but I can see someone who's new to mystery racing doing this wrong and just doing the left part first every time and then getting it's stuck a... on the right. It's worth mentioning the reason why Polkitsune is. Uh, screen was frozen for a second. Uh, you know, things are fine until this stage. <laughs> That's what they said in RC. Oh, Bill Kirby's not doing the left side. I, I just praised you for not doing this. Oh, here comes the bol The boulder! Bill Kirby should just observe a little. I don't know what. Bill Kirby hasn't learned nothing as a result of using violence. Violence is never the answer, chat. Ah, but yeah, this makes sense. The, the boulder is going to trap the mummy on the right side where the ladder is, and enemies who are stuck do not like being stuck and they will commit seppuku. Rokitsuna doing the left side, so it seems pretty. Confident. Rokitsuna gonna do the exact same thing as Beer Kirby? No, okay. I'm trying to figure out whether or not you could, like, cross the drills instead of, like, using the top one on the left, carry it through and see if that would work. I don't, I don't think it helps. Mommy's gun! Go! No! Grab the drill first! It's ah. too late! You hesitated! 
Ah, but, but that would have worked if Pokitsune had climbed the ladder earlier a little faster and didn't wait at the top screen for so long. They should realize that the timing would have worked out. Yeah, I've been tight, but you can it explicitly says in the paste bin uh, that you can walk through enemies while they're respawning. Kind of a clue in itself, right? But that's probably something you will be forced to do. Some kind of like with the timing. Uh, just waiting here is not going to work, I think. It despawned earlier, didn't it? Did it? It was just because the rock was Or was that a it? kill? I mean, I guess maybe. I guess they just res uh, die after some time, yeah. They like, best by date fires. All the bandages <laughs> start rotting. The bandages went stale and the grocery store had to throw them out. Oh, there it, there it is. is. There it goes. Just implodes like some star after a billion years. I must go. My planet needs me. Uh. Oh. That was interesting. Oh, no! Wait, no, not no. Okay. <laughs> For it a second. Works. So, in my head, the solution was to push the block one pile, right? Then Pokitsuna did it twice and it fell down and I was like, oh no, but... It's ruined. All of our hard work up until this moment I mean, is that gone. That would be... Especially since Bio Kirby hasn't figured it out and Pokitsuna... Perfect. Oh, you even On had to do that. I, I, I wasn't even looking that far. You had to drop onto the, on top of the boulder. There's no way to get to the door, uh, to the door otherwise. All right, how hard is this one going to be? Got some ladders, we got some of the jumping mummies. Yeah, these mummies were born after ladders were invented. And jumping, I guess. That looks like we got some platforms that disappear. Um, it seems relatively straightforward. Not good. Uh, fuck. <laughs> I'm gonna guess that you fall down the uh, the collapse of platform in order to get to the bottom ones. Wait. Oh, dropping down first. Ah, oh, smart. This works. Probably fine. Didn't want to. Okay. What do we do, do, we do with this thing? Top left of the bottom room through the floor? That's where Pokitsune is going. Oh. Uh, let me something about. Alright, big reset. But I think this level is not very hard actually. Pokitsune was almost there. So Bio Kirby will really have to step it up. I like it. Can get these two now, yeah. And then, and then Pokitsuna can do what they did earlier: collect that drill that is still on the screen, and get the last orb, orb on top. I think this is gonna be solved, 
right here. Okay, can not use this one for here, sure. One more orb, and they do have a drill. Ah, but, but they dropped into fuck. the soft lock. Ah, uh, but they should have used the drill for this one at first. But that that would have been a solution. Use the drill top left there, then collect the drill that is gonna be left on the screen. Get the orb on top. Go another round because why not? Loops. It's all important in this game. Yeah, and Parkitsuna knows it. It's doing the same thing. Gonna drill to the right here. Back up top. Meanwhile, Bio Kirby has figured out that this boulder is probably the path to solution. But I don't think. I just think it's not gonna be fast enough, even if Bio Kirby just basically placed a task at this point. My pocket soon drop down, yeah. I'm not getting baited. There's gonna be a solution. Uh, a solve. Using this. Ew. Close. Now do we go over the bridge? I'm a little confused when these bridges disappear. Uh, it's after walking off and on them twice, it looks like. Okay. Solve. And let's see it. Is the dot done? Where is it? Dot done with a time of 3529. Okay. Oh, there was someone else. <laughs> yeah, it's Yugi finished at the time of Looks like we can drag in Polkatune, hopefully. Hello, Polkatune. Some weird cry. A what? Please. Is there a dark corner I can fall down, curl up into a ball and cry? Oh no, what happened? I think you did pretty well. I did pretty well. Three, how, two seconds? Two? Not even? Oh, no, that's no, not no, your no, opponent. You, you won. Yeah, that's you, you win. What? Oh, you won. Oh, oh, Yuga oh, isn't oh, your oh. opponent. You, you Bayo Kirby is. You were not playing against Yuga. Oh, oh. Bayo oh. Kirby just forfeited, oh. by the way. Oh man, the, the roller coaster of emotions, <laughs> life. Could you imagine? <laughs> 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 okay, yeah, when I saw that dot dot just as I was typing O N E, I mean, and I assumed. I, I can also and... like calm your nerves a little bit. We would check the bot and actually see who's faster. It's not about who can type dot on faster. <laughs> we we frame check if we need to. <laughs> oh, oh boy, my apologies for the sudden panic attack. That's <laughs> holy moly. Right. He can drag in Bayo Kirby as well. Bayo yeah, Kirby, welcome. A good I... effort. I... Uh, good effort. Stage six. Yeah. Stage yeah. six. Well, I have no clue what the heck I was supposed to do on stage six. <laughs> so according to chat and what Polkitsune did, you're supposed to wait out the mummy to spawn. And then walk past yep. it. That's what I pulled. <sighs> I, it was the only way. I assumed it just did when it was I guess I just kept on killing it enough that it just never got to that point. I, I think it turned how many, that much number of times before it actually despawns. It's a long time, but it will happen eventually. Right. There's no way for you to be able to kill it, go back up, pick up the drill, and go around back and forth before it despawns. There's just no yeah. way. Excellent. One of you is actually really close, and it might have been doable. 
I, I, I thought that I was to like, because I'm pretty sure I thought that at some point the mummy and the rock guy were on the same square. So I was trying yeah. to do that, and then it just didn't work because it just walked. It just treated it as a wall, and it's like, okay. yeah. Uh, how I've tried to see if the the boulder version of the rock guy would have killed the mummy. I no. waited patiently, waited for it to roll down there. Didn't do jack. I yeah. climbed up the screen, climbed back down. The mummy was gone. Wait, what happened? <laughs> what the heck? What did I miss? Tried to use it as a platform. <laughs> you had to. You had to you know, just to reach the door. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you you figured it out really fast. I I was still stuck on how stupid it was that you had to wait for the mummy to just despawn. I wouldn't even have figured out that you have to stand on the rock. Especially when you're in a race city where your stick is rush, go now. You can't wait. It's killing you inside. Uh, uh, I guess most importantly, you guys have fun. That's pretty fun. I had fun. Stage six, I. Three people. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no discernible solution. No, it's not obvious. Even now, kidding that mummy feels more like an exploit than actually yeah. clearing the puzzle for it. Yep. That was. Uh, like, the, the game, at first when you look at it here, it looks really simple, and as soon as you go through stage 4, uh, to the first stage, no, you have to do things in a specific order, in a specific way, otherwise you're screwed. Yeah. It's very much about order of operations, yeah. when do I pick up which tool? Mm -hmm. That one... Like, the first stage that had multiple late ones, I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> I was like, where are all the treasures? <laughs> and then... There's a few missing! Uh, no. There's no treasure on this screen, yeah. <laughs> uh, why gay? <laughs> Stage uh, 4 is the one that has had the yellow mummy, right? I don't know. I think, maybe? Like, I, 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 like, I would've... I would've... Um... I think it probably would have. I don't know. I don't know how what the pace was. If stage six didn't exist, <laughs> this race would be much shorter. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like stage seven wasn't that hard. I had to do a few restarts for it, but it was fine. It... Six. Six is the problem. Yeah, because. GG, uh, uh, B.O. Kirby. GG. GG. That was... Mm. Also, uh, I, I would now have to wonder if uh, La Mulana did take some inspiration from the graphics of this game. Yeah, it's definitely a point of discussion at the beginning of the race. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so... Uh. Uh, congrats on your win, Polk Kitsuna. You will be playing against Zenic Reverie in World in in World Two. Winners too. Oh boy! Oh boy! Good luck! Oh boy! And Bio Kirby. Nice, Bio Kirby will be baby, fighting. Baby. Uh, Bio Kirby will be fighting against the loser of It's a Star Min and Persagonus. Okay. Oh boy. Good luck to you too. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Thanks for joining us, and thanks yeah. for racing. And congrats on the yeah, winning poll. And I believe that's it yeah. for us because, as we can see right here, next match <laughs> the long awaited match, Fart Explosion versus Tetsuya, is in 2 hours and 45 mm. minutes. Which is still a way away. Too long away. Mm. And then 3 hours after that, we're gonna have a double to of Kenya versus Soapy Gnome and. Bees, the one versus Jackie the Jack. Oh, wow, that's, that's kind of a like a nickname match as well. Who, who is more the than the other? X the Y, the match. Mm -hmm. Unless uh, maybe it's like Beast, he won. 
Maybe. I don't know. I, I like bees better, personally. But we'll find out in like 5 hours and 45 minutes. Yep. So, stay tuned, follow the channel to get notifications when we go live. Because we will be going live in just 3 hours for Part Explosion versus Tetsuya.